when you are attached to someone in an unhealthy way, it could be the most poisonous, the most dangerous thing for you. The problem with unhealthy attachment is that we don't know that it's an unhealthy attachment until after we are done with it, until we struggle and suffer so much to the point where we don't even recognize ourselves anymore. And that's when we say, wow, that was so unhealthy. When you are attached to someone, you are not thinking to yourself, is this healthy or not? All you care about is getting that supply that you need from them. Whatever it is, whether it's validation, whether it's love, whether it's comfort, whether it's having someone care about you in whatever way you define that care to be right, that's what you're looking for from your attachment. You're not wondering whether it's good or bad. That's when you are in an unhealthy attachment because all you care about is keeping that bond with that person instead of caring about whether it's the right bond or not. This usually happens if you are an empath and you are attracted, for example, to a narcissist. Because what happens is you have all of this empathy and love and understanding inside of you. And this person has the need to have someone in their life who has all that love and understanding and kindness inside of them. Someone who makes excuses, someone who sees past all of their negative behavior, someone who's willing to put up with all of that behavior and you completely are attracted to someone like that because they are taking all that stuff that you have inside of you and in a way they also live off of what you have to offer because that's what they need so it's in a way it's an unhealthy attachment for the both of you but if you are struggling currently with being attached to someone in a way that makes you feel depleted at the end of the day that means it's unhealthy if you are feeling that without that person being in your life you are nothing you are a nobody that's an unhealthy attachment nothing and no one on this earth makes you worthy other than the fact that you are human and you are here you don't need that validation from another person if this person is the only one that you can see the only one whose opinion means something to you that's an unhealthy attachment and you need to let go of it bit by bit my advice is start by if you are listening to this if you are watching this video and you've gotten to this point that means you are in a situation that is unhealthy because something about it is making sense to you so this should be your first wake-up call the next thing I want you to do is write down a list of all of the things that make you feel that A, this is an attachment where you feel like there is a cord, you know, tying you to this person and B, write down all of the things that you feel are not right. And then I want you to ask yourself and you might cry when you answer this question, would you accept this kind of treatment? for someone who you love dearly, a friend of yours, your daughter, your son, your mother, whoever it is that's in your life that you love dearly, would you accept what you are currently accepting for yourself? And if the answer is no, then you know what you need to do. If you need to seek professional help, I highly advise that. But this is your first step. I hope it helps and have a lovely day.